Welcome to Dude RV. Hey, I sure appreciate you stopping by. You got here just in time. We are getting on the road. It is the end of February, and I just, just got the urge to get out and see another campground. So we're gonna hop in Miss V right there. We're gonna hop in Miss V, and we're gonna head out into the East Texas Piney Woods we are going to Lake of the Pines, and we're going to visit two Corps of Engineer campgrounds this weekend. Right now, we are headed to Johnson Creek Camp on Lake of the Pines. It's about a two and a half hour drive for me. It'll be about 60 seconds for you. So let's get on the road and go visit Lake of the Pines Johnson Creek Camp. Check that out. Man, isn't that awesome? How can it, how can it? So here we are, Johnson Creek Camp on Lake of the Pines. Wow. How cool is that? Took me about uh, three hours to get here, but that's all right. It just looks like it's gonna be well worth it. So we're in site number E315. And this is a, a, a smaller loop. And as you can see, there, there's, there's quite a few people here this weekend. But I, I kind of think this lake has got a lot of people all, all the time. There is no water, we're off season, but this is a water electric site. The pad is not as level as I was expecting. We're 3050 with a, a 15 amp plug as well. There's water. So all these sites, as you can see, have quite a substantial drop off here at the back. So I actually, I brought some firewood with me. And, and don't worry, the firewood that I buy it comes out of East Texas, so <laughs> I just kind of threw it off while I was getting set up. Nice big concrete patio. Aluminum table. What a heck of a view. Fire ring. The ubiquitous lantern hook. And water access. What more do you want? I'm only here at Johnson Creek Camp for tonight. And then tomorrow I'll be moving on over to Buckhorn Creek. 
I've heard a lot of a lot of good things about Lake of the Pines and now I'm starting to understand. All right. I'm going to go eat some lunch and deploy little red. And then we'll go see some stuff. little red all rigged up got a jacket on because it's a little bit chilly so let's go see some stuff had to do the scooter run I had to do the FPV tour twice <laughs> I don't know what what's going on. for some reason um, my lapel mic is messing up tent area number two and I like tent area number two because it's just it seems it's not quite as steep and the two sites over here on the right are just awesome these right here I think that's like uh, five and eight this is the exclusive boat ramp for the campground now right there ahead of this is also a primitive tent camping area and these are really the only parking spaces inside the camping area and then here we have the beach here there was a great big huge flock of pelicans of all things this is rv area number one and i think this is probably the most family friendly most family appealing because it is right next to the swim area and the playground they're asphalt sites. They'll have a picnic table and a lantern hook. I'm pretty sure they're 30 amp sites. I haven't looked inside the box to tell. Boat ramp. It's a steep one too. So my boat ramp fans, I'm sorry, we're not gonna go too far down. There is a nice six slip courtesy dock here by the swim area the beach now there is one detractor to Johnson Creek campground and that is the road it's a very busy highway we have a fishing dock that is not in any way shape or form handicap accessible there's a, a flight of very steep stairs spoke to a couple fellows that were down on that fishing dock earlier and they said they haven't caught any fish in three days. And this one right here on the left is my favorite. So this one right here is my favorite. They seem to be pretty used to people.
Where are we? Ah, we're at Johnson Creek. Johnson Creek Campground on Lake of the Pines. And as you can see, it's a dull, dreary evening, but I'm gonna spice it up. I'm gonna have some Lone Star Brats, and I'm cooking for breakfast some of these really delicious habanero breakfast sausages that I bought last time I was down there. Check that out. Man, oh man, got some mushrooms in a full pack, and then I have some green beans full packing, and some hominy. So I'll be feasting in style, even though we have thunderstorms. So I put little Red to bed for the night, because from that direction, we have more storms coming. So that's all for tonight. I'll be back in the morning. Stay tuned. More to come. Well, here we are. The Lake of the Pines. On the Verizon hotspot, I've got four bars of 4G. All right. I think I'm gonna have to close this one out. I'm gonna be getting in the truck and going to check out another campground here shortly moving this afternoon not much else to show you here except rain if this is your first visit to dude rv i really appreciate you stopping by and i hope you consider giving me a thumbs up and subscribing and for those of you who have been following along thank you i am i am so deeply honored man that's that's why i do what i do i I take you all kinds of cool places. <laughs> Thank you. Y'all come back now, you hear?